related to mandatory Palestine. On May 14, 1948, upon the termination of the mandate, David Ben-Gurion declared the creation of the State of Israel a Jewish and democratic state in the land of Israel. Immediately afterwards, all neighboring Arab states invaded, yet the newly formed IDF resisted. In 1949 the war ended and Israel started building the state and absorbing massive waves of Aliyah from all over fueled. Culture Religion The Jewish people and the religion of Judaism are strongly interrelated. Converts to Judaism typically have a status within the Jewish ethnos equal to those born into it. 160, however, several converts to Judaism, as well as ex-Jews, have claimed that converts are treated as second-class Jews by many born Jews. 161. Conversion is not encouraged by mainstream Judaism, and it is considered a difficult task. A significant portion of conversions are undertaken by children of mixed marriages, or would-be or current spouses of Jews. 162. The Hebrew Bible, a religious interpretation of the traditions and early history of the Jews, established first of the Abrahamic religions, which are now practiced by 54% of the world. Judaism guides its adherents in both practice and belief, and has been called not only a religion, but also a way of life, 163, which has made drawing a clear distinction between Judaism, Jewish culture, and Jewish identity rather difficult. Throughout history, in eras and places as diverse as the ancient Hellenic world, 164, in Europe before and after the Age of Enlightenment, see Heyskala, 165, in Islamic Spain and Portugal, 166, in North Africa and the Middle East, 166, India, 167, China, 168, or the contemporary United States, 169, and Israel, 170. Cultural phenomena have developed that are in some sense characteristically Jewish without being at all specifically religious. Some factors in this come from within Judaism, others from the interaction of Jews or specific communities of Jews with their surroundings and still others from the inner social and cultural dynamics of the community, as opposed to from the religion itself. This phenomenon has led to considerably different Jewish cultures unique to their own communities. 171. Languages Hebrew is the liturgical language of Judaism, termed Lashon HaKodesh, the holy tongue, the language in which most of the Hebrew scriptures, Tanakh, were composed, and the daily speech of the Jewish people for centuries. By the 5th century BCE, Aramaic, a closely related tongue, joined Hebrew as the spoken language in Judy. 172. By the 3rd century BCE, some Jews of the diaspora were speaking Greek. 173. Others, such as in the Jewish communities of Assyristan, known to Jews as Babylonia, were speaking Hebrew and Aramaic, the languages of the Babylonian Talmud. Dialects of these same languages were also used by the Jews of Syria Palestina at that time. For centuries, Jews worldwide have spoken the local or dominant languages of the regions they migrated to, often developing distinctive dialectal forms or branches that became independent languages. Yiddish is Judeo-German language developed by Ashkenazi Jews who migrated to Central Europe. Ladino is the Judeo-Spanish language developed by Sephardic Jews who migrated to the Iberian Peninsula. Due to many factors, including the impact of the Holocaust on European Jewry, the Jewish exodus from Arab and Muslim countries, and widespread emigration from other Jewish communities around the world. Ancient and distinct Jewish languages of several communities, including Judeo-Georgian, Judeo-Arabic, Judeo-Berber, Krinkuk, Judeo-Malayalam and many others, have largely fallen out of use. 3. Tombstone of the Maharal in Old Jewish Cemetery Prague 
The tombstones are inscribed in Hebrew. For over 16 centuries, Hebrew was used almost exclusively as a liturgical language, and as the language in which most books had been written on Judaism, with a few speaking only Hebrew on the Sabbath. 174. Hebrew was revived as a spoken language by Elizabeth Yehuda, who lived in Palestine in 1881. It had not been used as a mother tongue since Danaic times. 172. Modern Hebrew is designated as the state language of Israel. 175. Despite efforts to revive Hebrew as the national language of the Jewish people, knowledge of the language is not commonly possessed by Jews worldwide and English has emerged as the lingua franca of the Jewish diaspora. 176. 177, 178, 179, 180. Although many Jews once had sufficient knowledge of Hebrew to study the classic literature and Jewish languages like Yiddish and Ladino were commonly used as recently as the early 20th century. Most Jews lack such knowledge today, and English has by and large superseded most Jewish vernaculars. The three most commonly spoken languages among Jews today are Hebrew, English, and Russian. Some Romance languages, particularly French and Spanish, are also widely as. Three, Yiddish has been spoken by more Jews in history than any other language. 181, but it is far less used today following the Holocaust and the adoption of modern Hebrew by the Zionist movement and the State of Israel. In some places, the mother language of the Jewish community differs from that of the general population or the dominant group. For example, in Quebec, the Ashkenazic majority has adopted English, while the Sephardic minority uses French as its primary language. 182, 183, 184. Similarly, South African Jews adopted English rather than Afrikaans. 185. Due to both Chaist and Soviet policies, 186, 187, Russian has superseded Yiddish as the language of Russian Jews. But these policies have also affected neighboring communities. 188. Today Russian is the first language for many Jewish communities in a number of post-Soviet states, such as Ukraine. 189, 190, 191, 192, and Uzbekistan, 193, as well as for Ashkenazic Jews in Azerbaijan, 194, 195, Georgia, 196, and Tajikistan. 197, 198. Although communities in North Africa today are small and dwindling, Jews there have shifted from a multilingual group to a monolingual one, or nearly so, speaking French in Algeria, 199, Morocco, 194, and the city of Tunis, 200, 201, while most North Africans continue to use Arabic or Berber as their mother tongue. Leadership. There is no single governing body for the Jewish community, nor a single authority with responsibility for religious doctrine. 202. Instead, a variety of secular and religious institutions at the local, national, and international levels lead various parts of the Jewish community on a variety of issues. 203. Today, many countries have a chief rabbi who serves as a representative of that country's jury. Although many Hasidic Jews follow a certain hereditary Hasidic dynasty, there is no one commonly accepted leader of all Hasidic Jews. Many Jews believe that the Messiah will act a unifying leader for Jews and the entire world. 204. Theories on ancient Jewish national identity. Bible manuscript in Hebrew, 14th century. Hebrew language and alphabet were the cornerstones of Jewish national identity in antiquity. A number of modern scholars of nationalism support the existence of Jewish national identity in antiquity. One of them is David Goodblatt, 
205, who generally believes in the existence of nationalism before the modern period. In his view, the Bible, the pair of biblical literature and the Jewish national history provide the base for a Jewish collective identity. Although many of the ancient Jews were illiterate, as were their neighbors, their national narrative was reinforced through public readings. The Hebrew language also constructed and preserved national identity. Old Halfert was not widely spoken after the 5th century BCE, good Blatstitz Sad Smiley 206, 207, the mere presence of the language in spoken or written form could invoke the concept of a Jewish national identity. Even if one knew no Hebrew or was illiterate one could recognize that a group of signs was in Hebrew script. It was the language of the Israelite ancestors, the national literature, and the national religion. As such it was inseparable from the national identity. Indeed its mere presence in visual or oral medium could invoke that identity. It is believed that Jewish nationalist sentiment in antiquity was encouraged because under foreign rule, Persians, Greeks, Romans, Jews were able to claim that they were an ancient nation. This claim was based on the preservation and reverence of their scriptures, the Hebrew language, the temple and priesthood, and of the traditions of their ancestors. 208. Demographics. Ethnic divisions. Within the world's Jewish population there are distinct ethnic divisions, most of which are primarily the result of geographic branching from an originating Israelite population and subsequent independent evolutions. An array of Jewish communities was established by Jewish settlers in various places around the old world, often at great distances from one another, resulting in effective and often long-term isolation. During the millennia of the Jewish diaspora the communities would develop under the influence of their local environments, political, cultural, natural, and populational. Today, manifestations of these differences among the Jews can be observed in Jewish cultural expressions of each community, including Jewish linguistic diversity, culinary preferences, liturgical practices, religious interpretations, as well as degrees and sourcies of genetic admixture. 209. Ashkenazi Jews of late 19th century Eastern Europe portrayed in Jews praying in synagogue on Yom Kippur, 1878, by Maurice Gottlieb Sephardi Jewish couple from Sarajevo in traditional clothing. Photo taken in 1900. Jews are often identified as belonging to one of two major groups, the Ashkenazim and the Sephardim. Ashkenazim, or Germanics. Ashkenaz meaning Germany in Hebrew, are so named denoting their German Jewish cultural and geographical origins, while Sephardim, or Hispanics, sphere of meaning Spain forward slash Hispania or Iberia in Hebrew, are so named denoting their Spanish forward slash Portuguese Jewish cultural and geographic origins. The more common term in Israel for many of those broadly called Sephardim is Mizrahim, lit. Easterners. Mizrak being East in Hebrew, that is, in reference to the diverse collection of Middle Eastern and North African Jews who are often, as a group, referred to collectively as Sephardim, together with Sephardim proper, for liturgical reasons although Mizrahi Jewish groups and Sephardi Jews proper are ethnically distinct. 210. Smaller groups include, but are not restricted to, Indian Jews such as the Bean Israel, Nii Menesh, Koshin Jews, and Bin Ephraim, the Romanians of Greece, the Italian Jews, Etorkim or Bin Roma, the Taimanim from Yemen, various African Jews, including most numerous live Beta Israel of Ethiopia, and Chinese Jews, most notably the Kaifan Jews, as well as various other distinct but now almost extinct communities. 211. The divisions between all these groups are approximate and their boundaries are not always clear. The Mizrahim, for example, are a heterogeneous collection of North African, Central Asian, Caucasian, 
and Middle Eastern Jewish communities that are no closer related to each other than they are to any of the earlier mentioned Jewish groups. In modern usage, however, the Mizrahim are sometimes termed Sephardi due to similar styles of liturgy, despite independent development from Sephardim proper. Thus, among Mizrahim there are Egyptian Jews, Iraqi Jews, Lebanese Jews, Kurdish Jews, Moroccan Jews, Libyan Jews, Syrian Jews, Bukharian Jews, Mountain Jews, Georgian Jews, Iranian Jews, 